Hello kids. Welcome to the maths class. Today we will do the topic face value and place value. The main objective of today's learning is to know the place value and face value of three digit number. Let's discuss what is face value and place value through this video. Once there was a boy whose name was Mac. He went to the house to take some coins and he got so many coins there. Then he moved to another house and then again he got coins. And at last he moved to third house. There again he got some coins and he became rich. Thus, he moved from one house to another. His place changed but his face remained same. Now, let us compare Mac with a number. When we move a number from one place to another, its place changes but its face remains same. As you can see in this example, first the place of 7 is hundreds but in next example the place of 7 changes from hundreds to tens but the face remains same. So, the face value is the name of that particular digit. Whereas, place value is the position where that digit stands. Now, let's see few more examples. Now, read the statement carefully with me. Write the place value and face value of underlined digit. It means, whichever digit is underlined, we will write the place value and face value of that digit. So, number 1, 286. Here 2 is underlined, so we will write the place value and face value of 2. But before writing it, our first step is to write down the place value chart. That is 1s, 10s and 100. Now PV means place value. So first we will write the place value of 2. Now, what is written on 2 hit 100. So, the place of 2 is 2 hundreds. Place of 2 is 2 hundreds. So, we will write here 2 hundreds. Spell hundreds with me. H-U-N-D-R-E-D-S hundreds. Or now, hundreds has two zeros. So, we will write two and two zeros. Two hundreds. Now, next we will write the face value. FV means face value. Face value of two. So, what is the face value of two? Two. We will write that number only. So, place value of 2 is 2 hundreds and face value of 2 is 2. Let's move to an, another example. 371. Here we will write the place value and face value of 7. So, before writing it, first we will write down the place value chart. So, we will write 1s, 10s. And hundreds. Now here the PV again place value of 7 is 7 tenths. Now seven above 7 tenths is written. So place value of 7 is 7 tenths. Spell tenths. T-E-N-S. Tenths. Or now 7 tenths. Tenths has 1 zero. So, with 7, we will write 1, 0. Now, next is face value. Face value of 7. What is the face value of 7? 7. So, we will write 7. Now, let's see an, another example. 459. Again, now here we will write the place value and face value of 9 but before writing it we will write down the place value chart first 
that is ones tens and hundreds now here we will write the place value of 9 so above 9 what is written ones so place of 9 is 9 ones we will write here 9 ones spell ones with me o n e s ones or 9 with ones no zero is there so we will not write any zero with 9 now next is again face value what is the face value of 9 9 we will write that number only so face value of 9 is 9 let's do one more example now read the statement carefully with me write place value and face value of the following digits it means we will write the place value and face value of all the digits number one 569 but before going to write the place value and face value our first step is to write down the place value chart and that we always start from the right side that is from ones side so we will write ones tens and hundreds we will always start place value chart from the right side but when we going to start writing the place value and face value we will start it from the left side so first we will write the place value and face value of 5 now what is written on 5 heads 100 so the place value of 5 is 5 hundreds so we will write here 5 hundreds spell hundreds with me h u n d r e d e s hundreds or how many zeros hundred has two zeros so we will write five hundred with two zeros now what is the face value of five face value is means the name of that number so face value of five is five now next we will write the place value of six on which place six stands the place value of 6 is 6 tens as tens is written above so place value of 6 is 6 tens spell tens with me t e n s tens or tens has one zero so we will write here 6 zero 60 now face value of 6 face value of 6 is 6 now next is the place value of 9 now what is the place value of 9 what is written on 9's head once so the place value of 9 is 9 once o n e s once or 9 1 has no 0 so we will not write any 0 with 9. So what is the face value of 9 now? The face value of 9 is 9. Now let's recall what we have learnt today. Face value is the name of that number. It remains same. Place value is the position of the number where it stands, that is, ones, tens, or hundreds. So, children, open your snap homework and your maths book and do the related sums. Thank you. Have a nice day.